A Queen's birthday honour has certainly struck a chord with Tasmanian musician Donald Ives. I will accept it with, with graciousness because it's, it's, uh, it's wonderful. It all began for the Longford resident when his parents encouraged a young Donny to take up the piano. When I was little, it was through the Second World War, and uh, I would sit on the mat playing with my cars and mum and dad would be singing the, the war songs. So by the time I was 12, I could play them. It wasn't long before he was an accomplished, classically trained musician who could perform any genre, including jazz and popular music, hitting all the right notes. I got a wonderful compliment from a Sydney judge who wrote, I've still got the paper, he said, this, this boy is a musician. A devoted family man, Donald has worked tirelessly for his community, but he says passion is the key to success. What I've tried to do is play music from the heart, because that's where it comes from. Donald's next gig, the Longford Jazz Festival this September. Also acknowledged with an OAM, New Norfolk-born Colleen McGann. I started work at the tender age of 15, intending uh, to be a teacher, but you had to wait until you were 16. So I uh, got a job at St Luke's and I stayed for 52 years. Colin enjoyed a decorated career in the sector, which included being named Telstra Businesswoman of the Year when she was 56 in 2002. The same as this award, it's not about me, it's about the people that helped me get to where I am and to do the things that I was able to do. Amongst the 12 Tasmanian recipients, also acknowledged Dr Rosemary Callingham for services to mathematics and Rex Wilson for services to education. All the things you are, are mine. Oh, yeah. Shelley Spencer, Win News.